Hello everyone, it's your girl Delicracy here, obviously. And welcome to a brand new video. Cheers, you guys. I hope you're doing well and I hope you're having a really good week. Today's video, we're doing a little bit of creator sim. I'm going to be giving my teen sims from my Get Famous Let's Play Star and Cosmo a makeover. And they're from a very wealthy, spoiled upbringing. So they're going to be pretty big label, fancy fashion forward, if that makes sense. So that's what we're going to be doing. And if we have time, I might also renovate their rooms, but I'll just see how long we take. Cause usually knowing us, we take a very long time and create a sim. So <laughs> without further ado, let's get into it. Cheers. Oh, and if you'd like to get your own, obviously t-shirt, you can uh, just click the link in the description down below to go to my merch store. Check it out. You guys, there's a little plum bob face. Isn't it cute? Just like a little surprise on the back for you. Alrighty, Ojo. So if you guys don't watch the LP, that's okay. But this is our Sim Cosmo here, who's aged up. I've given him a few moles. I've actually shaped his eyebrows a little bit and I've opened his lips a little bit because I did get a new lip slider addition to create a Sim. Um, it's like custom content to be able to do this. I've linked it in my recent create a Sim like CC haul video. Um, but yeah, usually the lips are closed. With this, you can open lips slightly. And so I'm giving them both slightly open lips because um, it's just fun. It's just something a little bit different to play around with. So Star also has that. Star in the last part, we started giving her a little bit of a makeover. Like she's the kind of teenager who's growing up way too quickly. Like she's already got her false lashes. She's got her lip gloss on. She's got her highlighter on and she's like probably 14 or 15 years old. So. You know, which a lot of people that age, some of you guys that age um, would also do, but for a lot of people that's actually growing up quite quickly. So, you know, we all come from different places. We all have different expectations, but yeah, this is Star. <laughs> so I might actually work on Cosmo first. We've got his moles and stuff. I think it would be kind of cool to have some piercings. And the idea that we had for Cosmo is that he's gonna get into the stylist career because I thought it would just be kind of, I don't know, fun to have him in the stylist career as opposed to doing what most people might expect and that's having a female in the stylist career. So maybe we'll just give him some cool like matte black earrings on one ear and maybe on the other ear we can do like a, I don't know, a high piercing on that. Nah, I don't like that one. Oh, I wanted to do this like inner ear piercing but still have the other ones on the other side. But if I click that one, then it gets rid of the other ones, which is really sad unless we have like both on both ears. No, that gets rid of them as well. <laughs> this is so sad. I want to have both of them, but it won't allow it. That's okay. We'll just have the, like the higher piercings. And I actually learned that it's really hard for custom content piercings to be made because it's really hard for it to like not stretch and still fit the face. So that's kind of cool. Also, does he have black hair? See, I thought in some light, his the sides of his hair looks kind of gray. See how it's kind of gray looking, but when you choose the gray black one, it's all black looking. I think we're gonna give him like the black the, the black gray because it looks more black to me than than this one but then the gray is kind of fun okay fine we'll keep that one and in terms of his style what should we do like we could make him super out there uh, no not this not this can't do that cannot deal with that we have some strangeville items that i knew that could kind of work on him maybe or maybe mm, maybe they don't really work no they don't suit him at all wow that's a weird fitting top I think we'll give him the Get Famous classic jacket because this is just like the classic Get Famous one. I feel like every Sim in Get Famous needs to have that. I quite like these ripped jeans with it from Strangeville because it looks like they're super overpriced ripped denim maybe. And then he needs to have, oh my gosh, not with this outfit, but he should have those Versace, Gucci, something shoes they just look like they might be a super expensive brand i have the hiccups i mean this is a look it's nothing like too stylish but remember he's only a teenager so we're gonna build him up to the stylist career i also feel like this is kind of cool he can wear this as a teen maybe he has some like over the top leather jacket that's some designer piece off the runway that's meant to look like a legit bikey jacket oh and we should use the get famous leather pants which i never get to use in this let's play so i feel like maybe Maybe Cosmo's the one to kind of bust the leather pants out. They're pretty cool. I don't, know, I don't mind a guy in leather pants. 
I'm pretty sure his dad has like the same jacket. I feel like it's a little bit much putting leather on leather, even for this family. So what we might do is just do like the less is more look and put just a plain white t-shirt with the leather pants. And then we'll use that um, jacket that matches his dad's in another outfit. Also, are these shoes a good idea with these leather pants or should we go these shoes? I mean, ugh, no, I can't. They're just, they, no. Ooh, we can do these though. These would work, okay. Uh, I mean, some, these sneakers look like they're worth a lot of money. Oh, and really wealthy teen boys always have like, Watches. There we go. He can have like this watch on, which I think he should have for every outfit. Like his dad got him a designer watch when he aged up. You know what? I don't like this outfit anymore. I'm going to get rid of it. I think we'll give him this jacket with these ripped jeans and maybe the other get famous shoes that look like really snazzy, expensive sneakers. And then this one. Now I still do I don't like this outfit either. We've, we've developed his style over time and it's changed within this Kaz um, creator sim video. <laughs> There's actually a really cool jacket with Strangerville that we got, which I'm kind of tempted to use. It's this one, it's this military jacket. Like, I think that's pretty cool. This could be a very expensive designer item, definitely. Uh, what is this? Is this from the holiday pack? Yeah, maybe not for him. <gasps> what about the biker jacket with the leather pants? Now that is, that is out there, but it could work. Oh, these are kind of cool. Ooh, I like these, yes. I wish they were cropped at the ankles though. I feel like that would work better. Yeah, I don't think these are happening. They're not happening today, Cosmo, not today. See, this is extra. Oh my gosh, imagine if he had like bright colored pants. See, I think he will get into the bright colors, but for now we'll, we'll make it a little bit more laid back. Cause I mean, that's still pretty out there. And maybe we'll do this top. Where was this top from Get Together? This top's like, it's he's wearing a chain, you guys. He's wearing a chain, so he means, he means business I think maybe in the mustard color I mean the red doesn't look too bad on him like he suits red but I feel like the mustard or the cream maybe we'll go the cream and then in terms of jeans I think the gray is a little bit dull so blue and mustard works quite well together because um they kind of are complementary to each other but I'm actually thinking why are there no black swatches of these torn jeans they would look so good in black. Maybe we'll go with these like brown leather sneaker things with these jeans from, are these jeans from Bowling Stuff? Cause they're actually quite nice jeans. Maybe we should switch them up into a couple of other outfits. I mean, maybe this outfit would benefit from the laundry jeans. I mean, bowling jeans. Yeah, they actually look quite nice. Cosmo, you have a new favorite pair of jeans. What do you think of them? Here, yeah, they're real swell. I don't know why I'm so weird. Oh my gosh, for formal, can we please go this like super over the top? I don't even know what this is, but let's just go with it. I really love these like track pants. I think they're so cool in the tan color. So maybe we'll go these for his workout wear just with a plain black t-shirt. I think this is, or a white t-shirt, this is one of my go-to looks that I've already done for a few Sims, but I just, I think it looks so nice. There we go. And we'll also give him a version of this where by he can just wear shorts. Oh, he can get some little short shorts on. Woohoo. I'm sorry, Cosmo, but that, that little pajama top, as cute as it is, it's gotta go, as well as these um, these shoes. I think you're more of a guy who would just wear like kind of cool track pants. <gasps> we could wear the hot track pants. I love them. Why does he have so many sleep options? Wait, what? Did he age up with multiple sleep options? Is that because as a kid he had multiples, so they randomized multiples? Okay, fine, you can have the love hot shots. No, not the love hot shots. You can, you can have tidy whities. Is it tidy whities or tiny whities? I'm not really sure. He can wear this to a party. No, I, I think that's a little much. He could do like a blazer look, which is a little bit extra, probably a little bit unnecessary, but maybe he just feels like dressing up for the parties, you know? <gasps> Then we can get him to wear these fancy shoes. The Gryffindor red shoes. I don't know what they are, but they're like some fancy purple shoes. So when he goes to parties, he can be like, hi everyone, I'm Cosmo Moon. Oh my gosh, he looks like a boy who you shouldn't date. <laughs> Yeah, swimwear is not that exciting. We'll just go with like some purple ombre shorts and maybe for sunglasses, we'll just go with the safety net of some aviators. Can he wear the cool pants for hot weather? <laughs> you guys are like, no more cool pants for you, Deli. You've had enough time with the cool pants. We'll get like just this nice like tropical outfit, something simple yet refined. 
I kind of want it to look like he's semi went and bought it off a mannequin. Like his outfit's a little bit too perfect. That looks like rich boy clothes to me. I don't know. It looks too perfect for a teenage boy. Not that some of you teenage boys are impeccably well dressed, but I just feel like this is expensive. And maybe this can be his cold weather look. Like that's pretty bougie. Okay, I'm gonna switch this t-shirt to red because I feel like that looks a little bit more rich boy. And you know what? This jacket is not working, you guys. I say we go back to the other jacket that we've put for him in his cold weather palette, which is from the City Living pack. And I say we go with that because it just looks rich boy as well. I mean, it looks like it's Fen Fendi or something, doesn't it? Like a Fendi jacket. So I don't know how many parties he's gonna go to. Hopefully a few, but let's just give in this because we don't know. And that's, that's the whole look, I guess, for him. So let's move on to Star. So when I look at Star's face, I feel like she could do with a little bit of blush, but I'm not really, I can't, I do need to find some better blush in my game, I think, because it barely shows up on her. Like, I feel like the blushes really, they don't work very well on skin other than fair skin in the game. I don't know if you guys disagree with me, but it's just not as nice, I don't think. So we definitely need some more blush options. She can have, ooh, ooh, she needs nails because girl would get her nails done with her mom like every week. I really want like a mustard yellow na nails with this outfit, but we might just go with like a burgundy color. She could wear a necklace with this outfit because there's not a whole lot going on, but to be honest, I don't know if there's really any necklaces that suit it that well other than maybe this one, but I don't know, I'm just not feeling it. She doesn't look that, it just doesn't look quite right. She can have a nice watch like her brother does. And let's move on to another outfit. I do want to use some of the new custom content um, I put in my game just for a bit of fun. If we could do like this little dress with some sneakers on like her brothers. Yeah, I think that kind of works for her. And then maybe some hoop earrings. Homeboy's gonna get it. Homeboy's gonna like get it. There we go. She's all like blingy. This is so cool because it's like the teenage version of Imogen, which we never got to play out. But then I don't want her to look like too much like her mom. We want her to be different and have her own identity. But it is pretty cool, like exploring a similar character to Imogen as a teen. This is kind of cool. I actually quite like that outfit. Like that's pretty, I, know, I thought that was pretty cool. There's this like tracksuit trend. Oh my gosh, why doesn't this skirt come in plain Black. See, this is why I use custom content clothes because at least that's a plain black swatches. I think I'll go with these shorts from like these denim shorts from um, Bowling Stuff Pack. We could do it with slides so it's a little bit more casual, I guess. But I kind of like the idea of her always trying a little bit like too hard to wear the latest and the greatest sneakers or what have you, maybe these high top things. Oh, I love this top so much. This is, I, I thought this was such a great top that we got. Ooh, I do like this top though. She looks gorgeous in that color. Maybe let's put this top with these heeled boots and skinny jeans. These are just the Get Famous jeans with um, the makeup brushes removed from them. They're in my CC video as well. But she looks stunning in these. Let's give her the like super, oh, not that one, this one. Yes. Oh my gosh, obsessed. Then this can be her final look. So I've also gone ahead and changed some of the hairstyles on some of the outfits, or just to mix it up a bit, because she had the same hairstyle in all of them. How awesome is this hair? Don't you reckon she looks sick? And uh, then she's got the long, low back ponytail. This is a little bit like Kylie Jenner look, in my opinion. Uh, and then this one's a little bit more like basic. Ooh, formal wear, she's got to have something pretty cool. Maybe we'll go this pink dress with um, one of the lighter lipsticks or the more, the more purpley lipsticks. I think they look pretty cool. Uh, then some highlighter on her or maybe mm, the blush is a lot of pink with that dress. <laughs> oh, and a cat eye perhaps. And then maybe a smoky eye we can do. Uh, we have some pinky things, but I think the smoky eye works quite well. And then in terms of accessories, we need to have some like get famous drop earrings perhaps in the pink. Oh, the pink doesn't really work that well, does it? Um, or we could go like glistening black ones. Fans, are we a fan of the fan? I'm not a fan of the fan. Let's not do the fans. Ah, oh, not the waffle earrings. 
them. My gosh, none of the earrings work. I think the black ones are probably the best option that we have. And then a hairstyle, I don't know. I feel like it should be tied back because then if it goes over the dress, it kind of ruins that beautiful asymmetrical line of the dress. Although she could have her hair pulled ah. to the back. Actually, I think that works quite well. And then last of all, we just need to make sure that she has her nails done, maybe a few rings on. I think we'll go the black nail polish with just like some blingy ringies, just like that. And I think that looks quite nice. Maybe we'll go the silver though. I think we'll go no makeup for her workout gear because honestly, I don't know how people work out with makeup on. I feel like I would be destroying my pores. I just can't do it, you guys. So she can just have like a nice bright top on black leggings simple dimple oh my gosh is this could this be a pajama top i think we'll just put her in this like little matching outfit for bedtime and maybe put her hair up into a bun i'll just tie her hair back i think for party wear we'll go this little red mini dress this kind of reminds me of the film clueless when she goes in that little red dress she looks so cute, but her dad's like, is that what you're wearing or something like that? I can't quite remember, but I'm pretty sure she wears like a little red dress, something along those lines. Maybe the white nails with the red for a change. I know some of you guys are cringing at my fashion choices, but hopefully some of you guys like them. <gasps> oh my gosh, her lips, her lips look amazing with red lipstick. Wow. She's like, oh. I'm obsessed. When you want to be your sim, when you want to become your sim. I actually don't mind this hair with this dress. I think we might leave the hair as is. She looks cute. I'm gonna give her this swimsuit. For hot weather, actually we'll put her in this cute little romper with wedges and this matching earrings and Ariana Grande hair. And then this can be her winter wear with her little beanie and like this off the shoulder sweater that I got. Um, I think she looks pretty cute with the dark lipstick as well. So that is their makeover is complete. So let me know what you guys think. Do you like their new looks? Do you think they look like they suit their characters? Would you wear this? Let me know in the comments down below, but I'm excited to see how these guys um, turn out and maybe we'll have a bit more gameplay of this let's play um, so we can actually see what kind of sims they are and if they get any more famous. Anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching this video. Please give a big thumbs up if you enjoyed it and would like to see more videos like this. And of course, as always, I hope you're having a lovely morning, afternoon, or evening, wherever you are in the world. I'll speak to you soon. So, so.